I want to welcome you to this small film, which is called The Greening of Paris. You will see uh, that uh, in this film uh, we talk about the larger problems of climate, CO2, environmental quality, life quality for citizens. But at the end of the day, the, the trick is uh, how we move toward this by moving away from an old system toward a new one. Paris, until a few years ago, was like all other cities in the world and was trying to find its way. And at the beginning of this century, with the, when a new team came in place and decided to make their mark by turning Paris into a city that is much greener, that is more economically viable, that is more socially just, and in which essentially the city just works. So in the context of, of this introduction, we'll talk to you about four or five, a small handful of ideas which are making a difference in Paris and which you too can do in your own cities. In, in, in Paris, we have thousands of things that are going on that have to do with this, this reinvention of the transportation in this city. But it, it's not individual things, it's part of a fabric. And, and there's a mobility plan for Paris that the present government has set up, and it has five points. And maybe it's useful for them to recall because there are five points that any city can do. The first one, point one, is to act on air quality and public health. Everything that they do must center on the improvement of air quality and the improvement of conditions of public health for all Parisians. The second, the second part of this, uh, the Paris New Mobility Strategy, is to improve mobility for all, not just for drivers of cars, but for all of the people who either cannot have, cannot afford to have, should not be driving. The majority of people who live in most cities cannot afford or should not be driving cars, uh, simply because uh, driving a car is very difficult and very expensive and it costs a lot to the public sector as well. The third of the fundamental strategies of Paris that any city can have is to make the city a more beautiful place in which to live, to work and play. Your city should be beautiful. And this is so about uh, the fourth principle, which is sometimes forgotten by people who think in environmental terms only. But the fourth one is to encourage economic vitality. If the city, if what you do in the city discourages economic vitality, if it makes the city dead in economic terms, you've not achieved your objective. So the fifth pillar of the city of Paris plan is not only to make things better for the city of Paris, but for all of those who live around it. And they, they, they talk in terms of reinforcing regional solidarity. So what they do in Paris should be useful for Paris, but it should also be useful for people who live in the Paris region. C'était tout juste après la guerre Dans un petit bal qu'avait souffert Sur une piste de misère Il y en avait deux à découvert Parmi les gravats, ils dansaient